Now to good health. Ticked off. Local vets say they are seeing a growing number of ticks and tick related illnesses. And that's not just a problem for our furry friends. Dr. No. Frank McGeorge is here to explain exactly what's going on, Doc. Well, that's right, Devin and Kimberly. You know, for years now, researchers at Michigan State have seen more ticks moving into the lower peninsula and from the west side of the state to the east. Now, at first, they're moving into wooded areas, but increasingly, they're coming into suburban spaces. And now veterinarians are saying this seems to be a particularly bad year for ticks right in our own backyard. He said there's something on her. It's huge. I just noticed it as we were walking. Halston Atwell was stunned when her husband spotted a tick on their dog, Faye. It had bit her and it had been feeding on her and it was the size of a grape. We live in Berkeley. We have lots of concrete sidewalks, not a lot of, you know, deep woods, and we had never seen one before on her. So we were Googling what we needed to do to remove it, how we should remove it, if we should remove it ourselves, if we should take her to the vet. It's a concern they're hearing a lot lately at the Royal Oak Animal Hospital. Vet tech Nicole Harris says they're seeing a significant number of dogs testing positive for Lyme disease. In the last two and a half weeks, uh, nine cases so far. Symptoms can be serious. Lethargy, fever, loss of appetite, um, lameness. They've put out signs to educate pet owners, and they're recommending year-round flea and tick protection. There is also a Lyme disease vaccine available for dogs. Anybody that went up north, it was a recommended vaccination. Now it's definitely on the rise, so we're recommending it more frequently now. If you do spot a tick on your pet... You would have to have a pair of tweezers. Go as close to the skin as possible so you're able to remove the head. Pinch and remove but protect yourself with gloves. Holston says they'll be taking steps to protect Faye and themselves. Every time we come in from outside, just brush up and down her legs and, you know, on her belly and make my husband do the same. We're still going to go outside. We're still going to take a walk. Just being extra careful.